Hey St. Paul's, I'm Lacey. And I'm Faith. And welcome back to The Spin. First things first, let's check out what's going on around campus. The St. Paul's family has been successful in various activities within the past month. Congrats to the football team for a victorious start to the playoff season. This Friday, the Saints will be hosting the third round of playoffs against Jackson. Another congratulations to the volleyball team for winning state. The robotics team also scored top 10 in their latest competition. Good job, Saints. Wow, I really am glad that volleyball won state. Yeah, me too. And I'm also really proud of the robotics team. Ninth place, let's go. So, Lucy, what do you think everyone's two favorite things are? Well, obviously, angels and trees. So now Brian will tell us about the angel tree. Don't forget to stop by the Silver Nail House and see Miss McGee if you're interested in adopting an angel for this year's angel tree. Boy, am I hungry. Well, why don't we see what Michael has cooking for us? Oh, well, howdy. I'll meet you guys inside. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to make my signature breakfast pie. Now the first thing to a good pie, right, is the crust. What we're going to be using for our crust today, bacon. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be using our pan here, and we're going to layer it. Alright, we're just about done here. Throwing in the last couple pieces of bacon. You're probably only going to need about one pack of bacon. This is what your finished product should look like. Right? You know, nice, just, nice just coat of bacon. Just like a pot. And we're gonna take this bacon, we're gonna set it aside for now. We're gonna work on our filling. This is my favorite part. Alright, you're gonna need a big old bowl, about a lot of eggs, right? And these are raw eggs, so you gotta be real careful when you play on raw eggs. That's how you get salamander, right? So what you're gonna do is you're gonna crack a couple eggs up in here, right? Alright, this will be our last egg. Alright, in our big old bucket here, we got about 16 eggs. I don't want to spill it. But you're going to want to get a nice a little balloon whisk. And you're just going to want to mix it. So what, this part is going to take a while. You want to have it a nice consistency. You know? That's about right. You don't want any big chunks in there. You can't have a breakfast pie without sausage. Well, I like to use just some nice old crumbles of sausage. You're going to get that in there. Nice and simple. You're going to need maybe just about half a bag. This part's hard to mix in. You want to get it evenly throughout the eggs. So we're going to bring back our bacon. And we're just going to pour it in there nice and simple. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I like to use nice sharp cheddar cheese as a topping. You can get it pre-shredded, but like I say, it ain't as good if you don't make it at home. So I like to get my nice shredder right here, get a block of cheese, and just start, just start shredding. We got our cheese nice spread evenly across. Let's go ahead and throw this over here. Very carefully, without spilling. Pick it up. Put it on the top rack. Careful there. We're going to throw it on bake. Maximum temperature. Go ahead and crank it all the way up. Whatever you're thinking, handle. This is going to take a while. Yip Kaye, that's one hot toast! We're going to have to take this thing out back. Family seals. Have a happy November. Alright, now I gotta go get some food. Retweet. So let's take a brief commercial break. May I help you? Oh, there's so many great things I want from the canvas store and I can't decide. Well, why don't you fill out this wish list and your mom or whoever can come get you a present? Hey, 
Hey, I'm Eloise Willis's mother, and I'm just wondering what I should get her for Christmas. Hey, well, you're in luck. Eloise filled out a wish list. Hey, Miss Bullis, where'd you get your outfit? Oh, I got it from the campus store. <laughs> the helpline is to provide St. Paul students an anonymous way of reporting bullying and harmful behavior. You can't sit with us. It can also be used to report positive acts of kindness. The phone will be kept in the counseling office and any reports will be followed up by the school counselors. Call or text 251-375-4306. Hey, Faith, have you ever jujued on that beat? Well, Lacey, I'm not going to lie. I have. Several times. Mm. Well, I think a lot of people around campus have been jujuing. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, in that case, let's take a look. I don't care, girl. He's still going. Walked in this party and these girls looking at me. Skinny jeans on and you know my head and everything. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, okay. I want y'all to look, do this dance now. Don't stop, ayy, don't stop, ayy, don't stop, ayy, run a man on that beat, 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 okay. nah, do your dance, do your dance, do your dance, ayy, you ugly, you your daddy's son, ayy. Oh, wait, where are we? Oh, well, would you look at that? <laughs> well, that's all for today, folks. Have a great Thanksgiving! <laughs> Our family's here. Happy holidays.